In this video, we'll balance the equation for the decomposition of iron 3 carbonate. So let's count all the atoms up and balance the equation. We do need to be careful here. So we have two iron atoms. This 3, it applies to the whole carbonate ion. So we have 3 times the 1 carbon. We have 3 carbons and then 3 times the 3 oxygens. 3 times 3 is 9 oxygens. On the product side, we have the two iron atoms. Carbons, we only have 1. Oxygens, we have 3. And we make sure that we count these two out here. So we have a total of five. Probably the best thing to do is leave the oxygens till last and let's balance the carbon atoms. So if we put a three in front of the CO2, one times three, so that gives us three carbons. Those are balanced. Let's update the oxygens here. We have the three oxygens here plus two times three, that's six, which is great because that gives us nine and we're done. This equation, it's balanced. The key here, be careful. Note that this three, it applies to everything, to the carbon, to the three oxygens. We just multiply it by those. And then when you're counting your oxygens on the product side, you have three here. Don't forget these over here. Lastly, it's helpful to leave oxygen to last when we're balancing these types of equations. This is Dr. B with the decomposition of Fe2CO33, iron three carbonate. Thanks for watching.